coverage you can count on continues with Marty Ledbetter and Sports. Hello and welcome back. We have officially entered the winter sports tournament window with the IHSAA Wrestling taking center stage on this championship Saturday. Over at Bloomington North, several Wabash Valley teams look to advance to next week's regionals at Bloomington South. We start at 113 as West Vigo's Tory Buchanan competed for the individual sectional title. Buchanan ultimately comes up short, but her second place finish secures her a spot in next week's regional. All eyes were on the next match at 120 as two-time state finalist Sullivan's Lane Gilbert took on Northview's Seth Cowden. This match went into the second period, and that's when Gilbert puts on the pressure, securing the pin to claim the sectional championship and lock up his place in next week's regional. Northview Seth Cowden advances to the regionals as well with his second place finish. The 126 final pitted South's Harrison May against Owen Valley's Branson Weaver. Tied at four points apiece heading into the third period, Weaver takes the lead late to secure the individual sectional championship and keep his Patriots in front of the Braves in the total team score. The 138 sectional championship was between Edgewood's Cash Turner and Bloomington South's Evan Rudebush. This was another close one entering the third period, but Turner takes over from there to claim the championship and punch his ticket to regionals. 145 sectional championship featured Terre Haute South's Nate Lomach and Northview's Tyler Lee. Second period, Lomach in control as he locks his hands, rolls Lee over in the cradle to secure the pin and the championship. An important victory for the Braves as they keep pace with Owen Valley. Jumping ahead now to the 170 sectional final, Terre Haute North's Nicholas Sconch took on Bloomington North's Chase Hostetler. First period, Sconch scores with the monster takedown early in the match, but Hostetler would go on to win the sectional crown via points. Sconch's second place finish advances him to next week's regional. The 182 pound final was a big one for team points as Terre Haute South's Alex Rose took on OV's Jerry McBee. Third period Rose needing points to complete the comeback, but McBee maintains control and claims the sectional championship via points, also keeping his Patriots ahead of the Braves in total team points. Next up, the 195 final between Terre Haute North's Samuel Saunders and Owen Valley's Eli Henshaw. And how about the Patriots helping out their crosstown rivals as Saunders claims the sectional title via points, preventing OV from pulling further ahead of Terre Haute South in the process. The 220 sectional final featured Terre Haute South's Christian Verst and Owen Valley's Bryce Mills. Verst was on a mission to claim the individual sectional championship and give his Braves the much needed win over the Patriots. And that's exactly what the senior does as Verst picked up the technical fall in the second period. It came down to the wire, but for the first time since 2001 and 2002, the Terre Haute South Braves are back to back sectional champions as they take the lead late in overall team points. I'm ecstatic for it, honestly. Coach Cook, I, ha I have to give him all the credit. He has built up our program since day one. Me and Christian both, we've been wrestling there since we were about this tall. And it's just a great feeling to be winning with my brother and my teammates. I actually didn't know that was since early 2000s, but it's just so surreal now that it's actually happened. Being two years in a row, it's such a surreal thing. It feels great. Um, because everybody put in the work. Team Car Audio is just so great, and it's, it's everybody's uh, commitment that just made it possible. 